the game show where copying is good. Well, as long as you're good at copying, you, you've got to be good at copying. You've got to be good at copying because the aim of today's game is for our families to claim as many points as they possibly can because only one family can go home with a very special secret copycat toys. <laughs> <laughs> Good who? Good who? I reckon we should meet the families. What do you say, audience? Yeah! All right. OK, first off, we've got Shannon's family from Essex. Yeah. We've also got Olivia's family from London. Just heads. I like it. Nice one, guys. All right, lovely to have you on the show. Now, Shannon, you're the head of your family. Introduce the rest of your gang, please. Um, this is my sister, Kaylee. She loves to collect stuff. Excellent. And this is my friend, Abby. She is very flexible and bendy. <laughs> this is Abby's mum, Helen. Hi, yeah. This is my dad, Alan. He is always forced to do an Elvis impression. And this much. is my mum. <laughs> <laughs> she does a really cool tongue ripper. Excellent. Go on, then. Oh! oh! <laughs> you can't uh -huh, do it. Uh -huh, you can't do I it. can't do it. <laughs> OK, Olivia, you're the head of your family. Introduce your team, please. And this is Kane, my friend from school, and she's very sporty. This is Megan, my sister, who's very clever. This is my grandma, Anne, who's always looking after my grandpa at home. This is my mum, who works at my school in Banstead. And this is my dad, who's got two terrible middle names. Go on, Paul, what are they? Uh, Morris and Douglas. <laughs> Morris and Douglas? <laughs> oh, nothing nothing wrong with Morris and Douglas. Nothing wrong with it. OK, well, welcome to the show, guys. It's lovely to have you here. Before the show, we tossed a coin. Now, Shannon. Your family won it, so what are you going to do? Are you going to go first or second? Go second. Ooh, they're going to go second. Ooh. Interesting. <laughs> that means Olivia's family are going first. Let's play Copycats! <laughs> Welcome to Mime Time. Now, Julie, I have three actions here on the card. You're going to pick a card. You're then going to mime that action for the player next year, which is Megan, then Paul, then so on and so on down the line. OK, best of luck, guys. Close the door! OK, which one do you want? Blue, have a look at that. <laughs> Confident, just plastic. OK, take it back. All right, good luck to you, Julie. Your ten seconds start now. Open the doors. OK, good. Good morning. Very Fantastic well, guys. That means you get the full 50 points. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Helen, how's your miming skills? Yeah, I have my moments. You have your moments? Yeah. That's good. All right, good luck to you. Close the doors! <laughs> All right, Helen, silver or red? Silver. Ooh. OK, you reckon you can mime that? Mm -hmm. Nice one. OK, I like it. Confidence. Best of luck. Ten seconds, starting from now. <laughs> All right, Abby, you have to look a little confused, Abby, there, but... That's good, that's good. Go for it, Jenny. <laughs> Go on, Kaylee Otter. Yeah, nice. Very delicate. Very delicate. Nice work. All right, Alan, your turn.
All right, OK. Not bad. Not bad. Shannon, for a maximum of 50 points, any idea what Alan was doing there? Was it cutting paper? He wasn't cutting paper. OK, we're playing for 40 points. Alan, any idea what Kayla was doing there? Cutting bacon. It's not cutting bacon. <laughs> All right, we're playing for 30 points. Kayla, any idea what Jenny was doing there? Cutting a piece of material. Cutting a piece of material. She Ooh. wasn't cutting a piece of material. <laughs> OK, Jenny, for 20 points. Paper doing it? It's no. not bad. Oh. OK, we're playing for 10 points. Abby, any idea what Helen was doing? Is it sewing or cutting? <gasps> oh, it wasn't. Oh, oh you were no. all on the right lines with the cutting, but Helen, you want to tell everybody what it was? I was hairdressing. I was cutting hair. Oh, no! Oh. That's a tough. That's tough. <laughs> you were all on the right lines, though. You all had the cutting down. Sadly, that means that you get zero points. Oh. Oh. And that also means that Olivia's family, you guys won that round, so you guys are going to play our first game. Are you ready and raring? Yeah! yeah. All right. That's all right. You are about to play Lou Lid Lob. Doing? Welcome to Lulid Lob. <laughs> oh, the aim of this game, you're right, mate. Yeah, I'm all right. The aim of this game, our family members, one at a time, either drive their bath or their toilet up to the stack of toilet rolls. They have to place a toilet roll onto their spiky heads, mm -hmm. and then they have to come into this scoring zone, and only then can they throw the toilet roll through the zebra toilet lid. Yeah! Hey, nice Good catch! Pass. Good nice pass. Pass. OK, now our family will get the 50 points if they can get six toilet rolls through that toilet lid within the time limit. If not, 25 points will go to the other family for doing absolutely... Yes. OK, could you please mount your bathroom apparatus? <laughs> ooh, 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 hey, hey, hi, hey, hi. <laughs> Woo! Yeah! That's what I'm talking Careful. about. That's faster than that one, isn't it? <laughs> All right, Olivia, are you ready? No! <laughs> <laughs> well, the best of luck in three, two, one, go! <laughs> All right. Nice. Steady, steady start. Okay. Good one. It's good. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, Neely, you're nice. in the scoring zone. It's quite close, actually. Oh, oh go! Missing start. Here we go. Remember, guys, you need six toilet rolls to get the full 50 points. Excellent. Okay. Got to wait for it to get. Oh, 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 oh no! Oh, go, go, go! Yes, come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Wait for it to get closer. Good shot, Kayleigh. Totally. Wait for it. Nice. Yes! Yeah! Go! Nice work. OK, guys, you might have to start speeding things up a bit. You need come five on. more. Yes, nice work. OK. Come on, Kayleigh. Oh, OK. Come on, Megan! She's there, she's there. Wait for it to come down. Wait for it to come down. No! Oh! oh! Look at go! Difficult. One minute left. Come on. Come on, get that back going. Come on. You're in the scoring zone. Wait for it to get back. Beauty. Yeah! yeah. Go. 45 seconds. You've oh, got to be no. really quick. You could still do this, guys. Come on. That is fast. <laughs> Brilliant. OK. Oh! Go! Come on, Olivia. OK. Get on your head. Get on yeah. Your nice head. work, Olivia. Go, Lily. Here we go, here we go. Yes! Yeah. Yeah. Go, go! Good throw. Oh, that's quick. Go on, go on. Points and 25 points go to Shannon's family. Woo! So that means the scores on the doors are Shannon's family are on 25 points, but still in the lead with 50 points. It's Olivia's family. Yeah. Yeah. This next round is called Quick on the Draw. OK, Alan, I have got three cards in my hand. I'm going to get you to pick one of these cards. You'll then have ten seconds to draw whatever is on that card for the person next to you, which is Shannon, and so on and so on down the line. Any good, mate? 
What a dirt work all day doodling. I'm sure he does. Well, good luck to you. <laughs> Close the doors! <laughs> OK, Alan. Silver, blue or red? I prefer silver. Silver. All right, mate, the best of luck. Ten seconds, starting from now. Okay, okay, go for it. Okay, Jenny. Time's up. Interesting. Interesting. Very. OK, very. Abby, for 50 points, any idea what Jenny's drawn there? Um, is it a bear reading? <laughs> I love that I answer. wish it was. I wish That's it amazing. was a bear reading. It's not a bear reading. OK, we're playing for 40 points. <laughs> Jenny, any idea what Kayleigh's drawn there? Is it a tractor? It's not a tractor. OK, we're playing for 30 points. <laughs> Kayleigh, any idea what Helen has drawn there? <laughs> Chopping board. A chopping board. I like these answers. I like these answers. Bear reading's my favourite. Bear reading is my favourite. Okay, we're playing for twenty points. Helen, any idea what Shannon's drawn there? A baby laying on top of a postcard. That is brilliant. I love it. It's not the right answer. Okay, we're playing for ten points. Shannon, any idea what Alan has drawn there for ten points? A letter. It's not a letter, Alan. Tell everybody what it is. It's a toilet roll. It's a toilet roll! <laughs> Sadly, I'm afraid that means you get zero points. Oh. <laughs> Let's see how Olivia's family get on. <laughs> now, Anne, you've got a really good chance of going further into the lead here. How are you with the old drawing? Oh, I'm the next Picasso. Oh, hello. I like it, oh, OK. Right. Well, good luck, Picasso. <laughs> <laughs> Close the doors! <laughs> Blue or red? Blue, my favourite colour. OK. Any idea? Ooh! OK, well, good luck to you. Your Thank ten you. seconds start now. Open the doors. So tricky. Ten seconds, not a long time at all. Yeah. OK. Yeah. OK. Oh. Is it a tricky one? OK, Megan, for the full 50 points, any idea what Paul has drawn there? Is it a bike? It is a bike, but it's not what we're looking for, unfortunately. OK, let's open the doors for 40 points. Paul, any idea what Kaylee's drawn there? Wheel. It is not a wheel. Mm. OK, it's open the door for 30 points. Kaylee, any idea what Julie's drawn there? Um, a motorbike? <laughs> it is not a motorbike. <laughs> OK, 20 points. Julie, any idea what Olivia's drawn? A tyre. A tyre is not what we're looking for, unfortunately. OK, finally, for 10 points. Olivia, any idea what Anna's drawn there? Is it a stabiliser? Oh, oh, very, very clever guess, but it's not what we're looking for. Sorry. And go on, tell us what you're drawing. Bicycle pump. Bicycle pump, see? Ah, that is a tough one. Mm. Unfortunately, you get no points. Oh. Oh. OK, right, Shannon's family, it is now your turn to play the next game. Are you ready and raring? They look ready and raring. Yeah. Yeah. You are about to play Bigfoot Bangers. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to 
to Bigfoot Bangers. Now, the aim of this game is very, very simple. All our families have to do is burst all these balloons here, but using only their big, giant feet. Looking good. All right, <laughs> now 50 points are up for grabs if you can burst all the balloons within the time limit. However, if you fail to do so, 25 points will go to Olivia's family. For doing absolutely... <laughs> all right, guys, are you ready? Yeah. In three, two, one, get, get banging! Yeah. Right. Good. Very good! Wow! on 50 points, but in the lead now with 75 points is Shannon's family! <laughs> Welcome to the music round. Now, Paul, I'm going to get you to pick a popular tune. You will then have 10 seconds to recreate that tune using this highly sophisticated instrument. No, 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 no Mark, what? no, not that. This. What? What, it, what, it, what is that? I, don't, I have no idea. Really? OK, nice one. Okay, All right, well, could uh, everybody except for Paul put the headphones on so you don't hear what song Paul is selecting, please? Good luck to you. Close the doors! <laughs> All right, there you go. Paul, pick a card. I'll try the top one. Red one. Uh-huh. OK. You think you know that tune? Uh-huh, yeah, I do. OK, well, we'll play it into the studio anyway just so you can get it in your head. OK, Paul, the best of luck. Thank Ten seconds, much. starting from now. <laughs> very good, very good. OK, Kaylee. <laughs> OK, Julie. <laughs> Megan, I'm right with you. I'm right with you. I have no idea. All right. <laughs> All right, I'm go for it. Song. Beautiful, man. Well, Very to me, are you? Beautifully played there, but uh, Olivia, any idea what Anne was supposed to be playing there for 50 points? The Star Wars anthem. It wasn't the Star Wars anthem, okay. We're playing for 40 points. Anne, Here any we... idea what Megan was playing? Here we go around the Marlborough bush. It wasn't no Here idea. We Go Around the Marlborough bush. Okay, we're playing for 30 points. Megan? Three blind mice. Three blind mice, it's not three blind mice. Okay, we're playing for 20 points. Any idea, Julie? Mm, bar Bar Black Sheep. It wasn't Bar Bar Black Sheep. OK, Kayleigh, I've got to say, Paul did a fantastic job. Did. Any idea what it was? Postman Pat. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't Postman Pat, Paul. Tell us. Kylie Minogue, I should be so lucky. Let's hear it. Oh. 
Postman Pat. Postman Pat. Postman Pat. Postman Pat. Postman Pat. Postman Pat. Sadly, that means you get zero points. Oh. Let's see how Shannon's family get on. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Jenny, any good in the old kazoo? More used to singing in the shower, but who knows? Hey, you never know. This could be your instrument. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> OK, could everybody except Jenny please put your headphones on so you don't hear the song that has been selected? Best of luck, Jenny. Thank you. Close the doors! <laughs> could you uh, pick either silver or blue? <laughs> She's going for the silver one. OK. OK, well, we are going to play it into the studio right now. All right, well, Jenny, good luck to you. Your ten seconds start now. Open the doors. OK. It was uh, pretty rocky <laughs> from Alan. <laughs> OK, for the full 50 points, Kaylee, any idea what Alan was playing there? Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Chitty Chitty Bang Bang <laughs> is not <laughs> what we're looking for. Not a bad guess, though. All right, let's guess. open the doors. 40 points. Alan, any idea what Abby was playing? <laughs> <laughs> Great escape. It's not what we're looking for. 30 points. Abby, any idea what Helen was playing? Humpty Dumpty. It's not. I can't believe you played it brilliantly. OK, let's open the doors. 20 points. Helen, any idea what Shannon was playing? Flintstones. Flintstones! Well done! Similar to The Great Escape, yeah. you're granted. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. Well, well right. done, guys. You get yourselves 20 points! <laughs> OK, so the overall scores are Olivia's family stay on 50 points, but in the lead with 95 points, it's Shannon's family! Yeah. Now, Olivia's family, don't you guys worry, because it's still all to play for as we now go into our final it's game. Good. It's good. Hamster Ball Havoc! <laughs> Welcome to Hamster Ball Havoc. Whichever family has the most points at the end of this game will go home with today's Copycats prize. <laughs> now, this is how it works. Our families try and get round this obstacle course as quickly as they possibly can without knocking over any of these balls. Because every time they do knock over a ball, 25 points gets deducted from their overall score. Mm -hmm. Now, the first family to cross this finish line will win themselves 100 points. We've got Olivia's family in the orange hamster balls and we've got Shannon's family in the purple hamster balls. All right, OK. In three, two, one, go! go. So the two team captains send their dads out on the first lap and it's Alan for the purples and Paul for the orange team. They're about to bump so that might get things going a bit. Oh, a gentle nudge, but enough to disturb both pillars and that's two balls down for orange. That's Alan in the back straight. Sooner or later, he's going to bump into Paul. No fall is there, and Paul needs to get a shift on to close the gap. <laughs> Alan heads back into the studio to complete his lap, and he'll be handing over to team captain Shannon. <laughs> a great first lap from Alan, handing over a lead and a clean sheet to Shannon. Paul completes his lap without further damage, and it's the orange team captain Olivia up next. She doesn't look the fastest, but the gap isn't growing either, and it could get closer still. <laughs> exactly at the halfway point, they are dead level. Maybe Shannon will speed up if she realises she's lost some of that lead. 
Then again, Olivia might speed up even more. They head back into the studio and there's nothing between them. Bang, right in the middle. No harm done though. Now who can get round these pillars in one piece? The pressure gets to Shannon and she takes out a pillar that's 25 points away. And it's Olivia who crosses the line first. So it's Kaylee who starts the last lap in front of Abby, but only by a whisker. Now that ball is the one knocked down earlier by Shannon, so Abby is clear so far. Oh, it's not too soon. Oh no, that's one, two off for Kaylee. Expensive. This is anybody's race, it's too close to call. Both girls heading into the studio with just the pillars between them and victory. Kaylee taking a wide line into the pillars allows Abby to steal a march. She takes out another pillar, she's going for the line, she's done it! Fantastic race, won by the purples. Okay, Olivia's family. Now, unfortunately, you guys came second oh. in that race. Oh. <laughs> and you did knock over four of the balls. Whoa. So, Olivia's family's final score of the day is... Zero. Oh. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> now, Shannon's family, you won that race, so you get 100 points, but you did knock over three of the balls. So, Shannon's family's final score is... 120 points! Yay! Yeah. Well done, guys. Well Let's done. take a look at what you've won. From top team to big top, you've won this circus skills prize. Learn how to spin, balance, juggle and at the clown at your own day at the circus. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. Nice one, guys. Have a cracking time. It's the end of the show, everybody. No way. I know, I know. Olivia's family say goodbye. Bye! Shannon's family say goodbye. Bye! Join us next time on Copycats! Yeah. Oh. So I'm loving Christmas here on the CBBC channel. All these new shows like Copycats and, and, and Noel Edmonds has been here as well. Ah, oh, Christmas. Christmas, Christmas. Viva por la luz! Viva por la luz! Viva por la luz! Viva so you want por... Monsieur Pamplemousse? The old day. You want an insane French chef who attacks minor celebrities and insults our viewers to come on the television this afternoon? Mm -hmm. Eh, I'll go the chart. You got a petition together? Oh, really? Oh, we, the undersigned, demand that Monsieur Pamplemousse is given his own feature. He's got his own feature. It's on a Saturday at midday. It's a rip-off of Saturday Kitchen called Le Saturday Kitchen. He's not fooling mm. anyone. He's got that. We don't need him on now. And th these are all your Viva signatures anyway. Viva pour la lue. Viva pour la lue. Right, well, tell you what, since we're on live TV, shall we ask the viewers? Dean. Yeah. Viewers, would you like to see Monsieur Pamplemousse this afternoon? If so, email him to cuc at bbc.co.uk. And Dean. maybe, just maybe, we'll put him on after this. It's Barney with the best bits of Prank Patrol. Oh, oh but first, here he is with something else. Viva pour when Barney's away... Anyway, I've got to go to work. I'm going to be later than late. See you later, Nev. Love you, Barney. <laughs> Nev and Keith will play. Oh, ah, they just can't stop misbehaving. Three, two, one, it's 